Alright guys, well, finally got around to replacing that really ghetto 120mm uh, fan setup I had here on my Palette GTX 460 1GB Sonic Edition video card. And basically what I did was I replaced, uh, since the fan that I have, which I actually have it right here, let me grab it. It's right here. A little dusty, you can see the fan blade broke off of there, so I had to improvise, and here's what I did. Just used some rubber bands, and you got two thermal take 80 millimeter fans here. These run at about 3200 RPM, push roughly uh, 35 CFM each. And uh, this one right here is just a standard three pin. And uh, this one right here is actually, if you look down here, you can see it's a little temperature probe, even though I don't have it set up to work like that right now. And uh, if you're wondering why I went with two 80mm fans, this 80mm fan here, the shroud actually blows directly onto the core, and it goes through here and it gets on around on the memory. And then this one here actually blows on the uh, VRMs in there. You can see them. So I want to get good airflow on those since I don't have a heat sink on them at the moment. And if you're wondering why I'm running this, uh, any of the non reference video cards that have less than, uh, I haven't actually measured it yet, but there's a certain amount of space here with these stacked DVI ports. If you have standard ports on there and they're just on the single bracket, then you're okay, but if you have a stack type, uh, you're going to need a certain amount of distance between your core to get the shaman thermal thermal right shaman to fit. So uh, basically, cannot fit on this video card. But I don't plan on keeping this video card for very much longer. So this is my temporary solution. And basically, this fan over here uh, has two leads to it. You got this lead here. It's the RPM sensor, which it actually needs this to run. I found out. And then I have my power cables. Going down around here, and I just go in there and feed into the fan controller, which is uh, mounted right here. It's these two here. This is for the uh, main one on the core, just the regular three pin. This is for the VRMs here. So here's totally silent. And then let's do a, uh, just run them all the way up, I guess. Let me see exactly how loud they are. But they do provide quite a good amount of cooling. I don't know if you can hear the airflow actually coming out of here, but it's a good amount of air coming out of there, so. Hey guys, that's about it. Uh, any questions or any videos you guys want me to make, uh, I'll see what I can do. And uh, lots of videos to come, guys. Take it easy.